Hey guys, so today I want to share another method for keyword research with you all. And uh, this is a method but is used by Chrome extensions. So as you may know, there are a lot of great Chrome extensions for keyword research and one of them is Keyword Surfer. I've already mentioned this keyword tool before but uh, I just want to talk about it a little bit more because I have found a couple of things that I would love you guys to know. So this is basically Keyword Surfer, right? 600,000 installations. It's pretty amazing. Many people are already using this plugin and many people already know this is a great plugin but many people don't know how to fully utilize it and I hope I can show you a way to do it all right so what i have done here is i have already searched for cats right so this keyword is already searched cats so we are going to go below and here it is keyword surfer all right so you may know this there is a feature in keyword surfer that you can add all this stuff to collection all the keywords to collection all right and there is overlap now what is the collection collection is basically all the keywords that you want to track and then you can once they are added to collection you can just download the csv right and once the csv is downloaded you can just click here and you will have the data of those keywords so there are only five keywords here search volume now there is also one more column here and that is overlap right as you can see here overlap 70 percent 50 percent 25 percent now what is overlap overlap is simply a data that shows that what percentage of the currently searched keyword overlap with the given keyword right as in the sense of audience so how many people who search for cats search for dogs 50 percent right so dogs 50 percent so kittens 50 percent kitten 20 percent now that's kind of weird because at the end of the day cats don't only 20 percent search for kitten or and 50 percent search for kittens so it is giving us the exact word which people are searching for and you can basically get an idea that if you rank for this particular keyword which is going to be absolutely almost impossible because this is just a single keyword and a very very competitive keyword but if you go for a long tail keyword you can get the information that what kind of other keywords are overlapping and there's a possibility of you to ranking for on those keywords too so let's just see this keyword funny videos about cats all right this is a very competitive keyword i know this for a fact because this is keyword keyword has been around for a while but let's see what kind of data we can get out of this all right so i just clicked on that and now it is searching for this you don't even have to go to another page you can just click on the keyword and it will go to google and it will start searching so i have a couple of chrome extensions so it's going to take a little bit of time it's all right it is loading here in the bottom so all right let's see yeah here we go so 100 percent overlap cat funny videos all right so it's adjusted i think hold on where is it all right cat funny videos cat funny videos 100 percent overlap it's i don't know what is going on <laughs> all right why is it moving so much maybe it is because of the interface all right, one second let me see I can fix this situation here because I've got all these Chrome extensions and Max AI and all these AI extensions, Merlin. Now, what, in upcoming videos, I will talk about Merlin. If you guys don't know, it's amazing. This this particular keyword, Mer this particular Chrome extension, actually, it's amazing the things that Merlin can do. I will definitely talk about it in the future. So, all right, I don't know what is going on at this point, but all right. So I don't know why, but it is just getting lower and lower for some reason maybe the page is taking a lot of time to load it's all right you can see the search results here how many what is the search volume even the cpc now this cpc as you see here the cpc is from google ads data all right if you guys know this is from google keyword tool and i always say this the google keyword tool is not the most reliable tool to find out if so how much cpc you are you have to pay or if you write content about it how much money you're gonna get because a lot of data is skewed believe it or not google do provide us the data but it is very much skewed for some reason this is like maybe it is because of auto loading or something i don't know what is going on there is some error going on here and uh, yeah 
let's see if we can use the size screen size and fix the situation if we cannot just i hope you guys are already using keyword surfer but i highly recommend you all if you are not you can install keyword surfer from here i can tell you a little bit from here too so it is showing the overlap data this overlap data will help you decide how, what kind of other keywords your particular content will rank for if you make content on that keyword and i highly recommend to use long tail keywords and the kind of keywords that you know that there is not that much competition and i will be giving you some of the signals that you can see for that the keyword has a lot of competition or not the one thing that you can look for is what kind of websites are ranking on top top 10 top 5 whatever top 3 if the websites are high authority don't go for those keywords if you are new if you if you have some experience you may give it a try and if you if you see the websites are not that high authority just a youtube channel some random low subscriber youtube channel is ranking uh, then it's all well and good you can go for that so that's all there is to it for some reason keyword surface interface will, is just i don't know why it's not working properly on my browser but once you install it you can get a lot of results out of it so that's all there is to it i will see you in the next one thank you